with all your magic I disappear from view And I can't get After all that we've been through Still believe in magic Well yes I do Oh yes I do Jump! 
And welcome to KBLP and Encounters of the Strange Kind with your host, me, Denise Harris. So thank you for joining me tonight. Uh, We're going to be talking about a couple of things. The biggest one is going to be Nostradamus. And I'm going to start out with um, Sears because that'll lead us right into that. Um, Do you believe people can foretell the future? Do you believe in clairvoyance, uh, crystal balls, and all that kind of stuff? Um, I don't know if it's possible. I guess anything is. Um, A seer is someone... Um, he's supposed to be able to, uh, through supernatural insight, to see what the future holds. Um, soothsayer, oracle, prophet, fortune teller, crystal gazer, clairvoyant, uh, psychic, mediums, and so forth. So, what do you think? Do you believe in seers? Um, there's been a few that, um, have been believed, but actually, um, looking for my, through my notes here, what kind of went backwards on this. I started out with, uh, making notes on Nostradamus. That was, uh. Um, interesting, to say the least. Um, some of the most famous seers are Nostradamus, Edgar Case, and Baba Venga. Um, some of the most famous seers, psychics, and oracles of history. The, Delphi, uh, the Delphic Oracle, have you not heard of that? Um, it's the Greek Oracle at the Temple of Apollo in Delphi. Um, Nostradamus, uh, Edgar Case. And um, Baba Vanga. So these people are supposed to be one of the most fa- uh, most famous seers um, ever. There are seers. Um, they have been um, highlighted because either of the accuracy or the insanity of their forecasts and the serious of na- of the facts to which. Um, they they refer to. So, um, a seer, again, is a person who has the ability to see the future, to predict. Um, there's really no way to tell whether a seer actually, seer actually has a gift or not. Um, I suppose the only way you find out is if it comes true, right? Um, in general, seers work with percentages. Um, a good psychic can have a 50 or 60% success. Um, and that's considered very high, actually. So I guess they have a 50-50 chance, right?